All right, hey everybody, it is Tony and I am back. I have three TTMs again this Monday, but before we get a peek at the TTMs, we're going to take a look at the Brandon Wins TTM Challenge standings. And as you guessed it, Brandon is leading the charge. But Andy, Flying Dutchman Cards, your brother Doug sent me a message and said, Dude, you need to step up your game, otherwise he's going to just lay a, a smack of down on you. Now we're going to look at the TTMs, and the first one comes from Pro Football and College Football Hall of Famer, Harry Carson. Harry Carson, we should have met him. Back in 2002, when he was inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame, completely forgot that he was inducted to the College Football Hall of Fame until I started putting this together. Harry Carson, one of the most dominant linebackers in NFL history, obviously because he is into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. But if you send to Harry Carson, he will sign one for free. He will charge for others. So if you have more than a couple, one card for Harry Carson, throw some cash in there. Visit his website. It gives you all the particulars on the TTM and autograph request. Next one is maybe Hockey Hall of Famer Ron Hextall. Big time hockey fans. You tell me, do you think... Ron Hextall belongs into the Hockey Hall of Fame. He is in the Philadelphia Sports Hall of Fame. So he fits in this mold of Hall of Famers on this TTM Monday. Ron Hextall currently is the Pittsburgh Penguins GM. He started in that position in February. He was relieved of his duty as the Flyers general manager a year or so ago. And now it is on to the final TTM, and it comes from Cleveland Browns legend, Ozzie Newsom. Why am I getting so many Cleveland Browns back? What is going on with me? Ozzie Newsom changed the way that tight end position is played in the NFL. One of the greatest tight ends of all time. You might say that he's the best of all time. Depending on who you root for. But Ozzie Newsom, also a pro football Hall of Famer and a college football Hall of Famer. Though he was inducted into the college football Hall of Fame before the College Football Hall of Fame moved to South Bend in 1995. He was a 94 inductee. So those are all my TTMs for this Monday. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good one. Bye-bye.